All right, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Hinchin Hall. Today, we're going to do something a little different. It's going to be a little, not weathering, but I like to see my locomotives fresh out the fract, especially these uh, special pink schemes. So, what we're going to do today, we're going to use our uh, true color gloss there. Represent brand new, fresh out the fract. They made the little wash here on the uh, trucks to see what happens. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Of course, enjoy the music. And um, let's show you how to get it done. Very simple, easy. Already cleaned off the locomotives here with a little duster here to get all the dust out because you want that dust trap on that clear coat. So here we go. What color I should say is this from True Color. That's the thinner. And here's the gloss coat here. Now for me, I use 50-50. Uh, so say uh, two milliliters of gloss and two milliliters of thinner mixed together of course I mix it in my brush here with my little mixing tool here and I spray on the model now before you start spraying on the model my advice is to use the air and just blow off the dust off the model because you don't want that on your model when you spray it or put the coat down on it I just say I like them brand new engines uh, yeah, I'm gonna do for a couple of them, not for the whole fleet. And it should be a good project to do on the weekend, just to uh, spice up your uh, locomotive fleet a little bit. Have some gloss, little uh, weather locomotives, so you know you can have a variety. But this is my opinion, this is how I'm doing it. Of course, you can, you know, make, you make sure or use whatever you like um, because everybody does it differently and it all come out different results. And also, don't use the spray can because I used it on one of my models and um, it didn't come out too well. So just use the airbrush if you can get one there. And I got mine set to about 20, 25 PSI. So spraying.